The Aqua Drone is a UAV assisted deployment system for water quality monitoring. Our country is composed of more than 7,000 islands and approximately 65% of the municipalities are on the border coasts. With the country surrounded by water, it is expected that one primary source of employment is fishing. So what is water quality being monitored for? Zooplanktons are microscopic organisms that are important for many fishes, including some species that are cultivated in ponds, pens, and cages all over the Philippines. Zooplanktons are considered as one of the most important food sources to the aquatic organisms, particularly to planktivorous fish. Zooplanktons can also be used as natural water quality parameter. Why is monitoring zooplanktons important? The study of zooplankton is important for three major reasons. Number one, zooplankton constitutes the main food of most species, especially during their post-larval stages. Sustainable fisheries development partly depends on the availability of adequate zooplankton as the principal food items. Variety of fishes such as bighead carp, milkfish, and tilapia feed on zooplankton. Number two, dispersal of zooplankton over large distances indicates climate change. Zooplanktons are highly sensitive to temperatures, and with the rapid increase in rates of 10 degrees Celsius, most zooplankton species are short-lived. And then number three, there is a positive correlation between dissolved oxygen levels and the abundance of zooplanktons in a specific area within the lake. Zooplankton community is highly sensitive to disturbances in the environment. Studies revealed that salinity, temperature, dissolved oxygen, phosphate, and nitrate have a positive correlation with zooplankton. The current method of collecting water samples require innovation. The challenges experienced in the current method are the following. The need for real-time water collection and data analysis. This is due to the deterioration of samples during transport. Increased personal costs and safety. This is due to repeat sampling journey to the deep parts of the water body. Another challenge is the need for reporting which may necessitate for further return journeys. Why use UAVs? By using UAVs, the researchers can easily deploy the aquadron and allow it to gather data and water samples in difficult to reach parts of the lake, especially those that are located in high elevations without personally going into the lake using large boats and thus reducing risk and cost in data gathering. The manual control of the UAV was accomplished with a radio controller Autonomous control of the UAV was accomplished with a flight controller in a ground control station software called Mission Planner. Through Mission Planner, waypoints and commands can be assigned to the UAV which will then follow these commands in series. The Aquadrone will carry a deployment system that will be responsible for monitoring the water quality in a water body. The deployment system will carry the Niskin water sampler, plankton net, and multi-parametric sensors. The Niskin water sampler will be responsible for taking water samples at a desired depth, without the danger of mixing with water from other depths. The water collected by Niskin bottles can be used for studying plankton or measuring the physical characteristics of the water body. The plankton net is an equipment used for collecting samples of plankton in standing bodies of water. It allows researchers to analyze plankton in water samples from the environment. The multi-parametric sensors will be responsible for measuring water quality such as pH levels, turbidity, temperature, dissolved oxygen, among others. With this kind of technology, the project can help researchers in terms of ease of access to inconvenient locations as well as reduce risks and costs by removing the need to use boats to sail into the middle of the water body. The project also opens up many possibilities on remote water quality monitoring applications such as volcanic lake water testing. 
lack of personnel, accessibility of water bodies, and time constraints, especially after natural disasters and emergency, are some of the challenges that this kind of technology can overcome. This is the Aqua Drone, water sampling made easy using UAV technology.